Hello and welcome back to the Organ Loft. I feel that my progress in relearning the organ is not moving very fast and I realise there is something terrifying I must do. Will you come with me on a scary walk through the dark? Yes, every organist plays Bach's music and loves Bach's music. I love Bach's music too, but can I play it? No. This is a small collection of Bach's music I have. Book one is his, question mark, eight short preludes and fugues. I learned a few of these, such as this. But I never played them really well. I was only taught the notes and not expression or registration or anything like that. I bought book two thinking it would follow on from book one, but found it extremely difficult. Although I managed to learn the giant fugue and the prelude in G major. When I started learning the organ, I wanted to play that really famous piece, but didn't know what it was called. The shop assistant thought it was Toccata and Fugue in D minor, and subsequently found it and sold me Book 10, only for me to find out it was the Dorian one. So I bought the right one later, but not got on very far with that. Finally, having passed grade 5 organ, I wondered whether to try grade 6, so I purchased book 15, which contained one of the set pieces, a chorale prelude. I never entered grade 6, nor learned that prelude. So, I have decided to start again with Bach and see what I can make of it. Do feel free to comment any helpful suggestions or criticisms. I'm going to start with what I think is a fairly straightforward chorale prelude. Jesus Christus Unser Heiland, BWV 626. This is very apt for Eastertide. Jesus Christ, our great Redeemer. I say straightforward, but who in their right mind would take a simple common time hymn tune and say, 
I think I'll write a prelude in 12.8. I have to say though, it's quite a masterful work. It's marked Andante Serioso and Forte. I take it to mean fairly slow, stately maybe for the king, and quite loud and triumphant, but that triumph is held back in the minor key, reminding us of the true cost of this victory. And when we get to the power of sin he breaketh, an agonising B-flat appears from nowhere. I know I play wrong notes sometimes, but this B-flat is not a wrong note. It is an agonising cry before the happy major ending. As I said earlier, I know very little about how to register Bach's work, so please tell me your thoughts. I'm not sure if I should use a 16-foot manual stop or not, but I have decided, using the Freisach organ via Hauptwerk, to couple the great and swell with 16, 8, 4, 2 and 1 foot foundation stops with mixtures. I have chosen not to couple the pedal, but to have that as an independent part. This means that at the end, the bottom A in the left hand is audible over the pedal which is already playing that note. Also, I have no idea of tempo. I've listened to other recordings on YouTube and tempi vary a lot. I'm keeping it quite slow because I'm learning it and I feel it suits a stately tempo. Well, I've put a lot of practice in. I didn't find this simple looking prelude easy. I don't think I'm on Bach's wavelength. There was one particular phrase in the pedals I kept doing wrong. And frustratingly, it wasn't that difficult. It was just C down to A and up to G. Easy enough on its own, but as a whole, I couldn't stop myself playing C, A, F. But I got there in the end. So this is where I'm up to so far.